It was a cold spring morning, business as usual. I drove to work, took my coffee to my office, and waited for the cases to roll in. But today was different. Detective, I don't mean to interrupt you, but this is of most importance. Spill. My sister has been murdered. Tell me everything you know. Every night, I shower before I go to bed. So today I was getting ready to take my shower and I was looking for my PJs. I had everything ready to go and I turned on the water. I was stepping into the shower and I just heard a loud scream. So when I went to go check it out, I found my sister's dead body. So you're telling me your sister was murdered and you saw no one enter or leave the house? Precisely. Sounds like we have a murder investigation on our hands. Someone out specifically to kill your sister. Do you know anyone who would have reason to kill your sister? Someone who would know where she lives? Enemies? Lovers? Detective Merrill! Excuse me. Yeah, Lieutenant Richards. Detective Merrill, what the hell is this? Sorry, ma'am. You have a million cold cases on record. Do you know how bad that makes us look? You better get your act together or so help me. I just got another case that looks promising. This one better get resolved. Of course. If we don't get some leads soon, I'm gonna have to take over this case. Well, we could always work together on this. What are you saying? Like old times. We used to be unstoppable. Sorry about that. What was your name again? Peter. Peter James. Mr. James, do you have any idea who could have done this? No, no one that I can think of. She's had a few boyfriends, though, but I've never met any of them. Does anyone have bad history with you two? No, no one that I can think of. Okay, well, I gotta do some more digging. Call me if you get any more information. I didn't know what to do next, so I talked to Commander Nancy. Well, Meryl, has it come to this yet? To what? Do I, need, do I need to join your case? I think I can handle it. Um, what do you mean? Like the good old days, didn't you want that? I'm getting close, so I just need some support. I'll be here, waiting. All right, Jennifer James, who are you? I continue to search for any reason Jennifer may be a person to hate, to obsess over even. I look back now all the way to her early college life. She was quite active from what I found. Now I'm finding some info. Then I came across it. It was her. The Jennifer Ann James. My college sweetheart. I was in denial this whole time. Someone killed Jennifer. My Jennifer. Who could do this? This case? It just got personal. Hello, Detective. How are you? Do you have any updates? Actually, I just want to come talk to you. Uh, can I come in? Yeah, yeah, sure. Come on in. Come on in. All right, Detective. What you want to know? Uh, can you just show me Jennifer's room? If you really wanted to, it's up here. Come on. All right, guys. Here it is. Happy hunting.
Fowler, you're looking for Meryl? Uh, yeah, I think so. Um, uh, Jennifer, um, how was your college life? You know, friends, ex-friends, boyfriends. She got her heart broken a couple times, uh, like a fight with a friend or two, but there was really nothing like major or significant going on there. Got any names? Um, there's a mayor, Ellie, a Nikki, and uh, I think a Nancy. Did any of them have any issues with Jen? Not that I know. I think, like, there's a fight over a boy or something, but that got solved pretty quickly. So aside from that, now they're all pretty close friends. All right, I think we're done here. I'll look into some of the friends and ex-boyfriends. All right, I'll show you out. Finally get some leads on the case. Sure. Actually, can you tell me what happened that night? Um, yeah, I guess. What does this have to do with anything? You were there. Just want to get the facts right. I was in the shower and then I just heard Jennifer scream. Wait, you were in the shower? Not about to shower? My bad, man. I'm sorry. Um, fine. I was getting in the shower and then I heard Jennifer scream. Uh, thanks. I'll keep in touch. All right, thank you. Bye. Yeah. We got him. The brother. The only plausible suspect. Peter? Well, if you can prove it. I got it. It's all right here. All right, book him. On it. Peter, you are under arrest. Anything you say, Kenan will be used against you in the court of law. So proud of you breaking your streak. Congrats. Yeah, well, it would have been better if you were there. Yeah, well, you take all the glory. You deserve it. <laughs> I'm gonna go freshen up. <laughs>